wiki.easyvid.com. Search EasyVid Wiki before you decide. EasyVid presents the 10 best drones. Let's get started with the list. Starting off our list at number 10. If you're in the market for a compact racing drone that supports first-person view flying and won't cause you to drop a tear if it gets damaged, the low-cost Aris FPV 250 is a safe bet. It's ideal for flying in tight spaces. There's zero delay on camera transmission and it has a carbon glass fiber composite frame. However, initial programming is very hard. At number 9, the Holystone X400C has extremely responsive flight controls, which may be difficult for beginners, but once you have a little experience, it equates to extreme acrobatic flight capabilities and tons of fun. You can switch it for left or right-handed throttle use, and it offers easy assembly and maintenance, but it does need to cool down between flights. Coming in at number 8 on our list, the 3DR Solo has a cool video game style controller that will feel instantly familiar to gamers, even if you've never flown a drone before. This results in less of a learning curve, so you can fly like a pro on the first day. It features a single touch flight pause button and remote camera angle adjustment capability, however you do need to pay extra for a gimbal. To see all this stuff, go to wiki.easyvid.com and search for drones, or click beneath this video. At number 7, not every great drone has to cost an arm and a leg. The UDI 818A is a great entry-level option that has a number of great features, like intelligent orientation control, a highly elastic protective frame, and a 2-megapixel HD camera. It also comes with a roll button for an instant 360-degree roll, and super bright LED running lights, but you can only fly it in low wind conditions. Moving up our list to number 6. The Blade Chroma CGO2 Plus is easier to fly than many of the higher-end drones, making it a good choice for somebody with limited piloting experience, but who still wants a quality drone. Plus, its controller has a live video display. The integrated GPS gets good reception, and it offers settable and adjustable flight boundaries. However, it does get pushed around a bit by the wind. Halfway up our list at number 5, the DJI T600 Inspire 1 is built for true drone photography buffs. It has unique carbon fiber arms that lift out of the way as you pan a full 360 degrees for a totally unrestricted view. It can also record 4K UHD videos and take 12 megapixel stills. It's solidly built and well engineered and offers an over 1 mile flight range, but it is extremely pricey. Number 4. The unique Q500 Plus Typhoon is probably the best drone at under $1,000. It has a 16 megapixel full HD 1080p 60 frames per second camera and an impressively long 20 to 25 minute flight time. It's certainly capable of giving the DJI Phantom a run for its money. Its gimbal provides excellent camera stability and the camera produces minimal image distortion. It comes with a 5.5 inch touchscreen on the ST10 Plus controller. Nearing the top of our list at number 3, the AirDog AD10 is unique in that it doesn't come with a controller. It's designed specifically for autonomous follow-me filming with an 820-foot air leash. Plus, it's foldable for compact travel. It recently won CES's Best Drone Award and is ideal for filming adventure sports. It's very stable in high winds up to 27 miles per hour. To see all this stuff, go to wiki.easyvid.com and search for drones or click beneath this video. Number 2. The Parrot AR 2.0 is a great high-end feeling drone that comes in at a moderate price point that even beginner pilots will be willing to pay. You get intuitive piloting, long flight times, and crisp videos, all for less than $300. It comes with a spare battery and features auto-stabilization for indoor flying and live video streaming. And coming in at number one on our list, the DJI Phantom 4 is the best consumer-level drone available. It supports every feature you can think of, like auto takeoff and return home, live video transmission, and even comes with DJI Director software for editing drone videos. It captures 4K Ultra HD video at 30 frames per second, has a hover function for smooth recordings, and flies at speeds of up to 45 miles per hour. 
To see all this stuff, go to wiki.easyvid.com and search for drones or click beneath this video.